So welcome back. Uh, we're here for the uh, final uh, of the uh, Grand Prix de saint Um It's uh, Guy Conte uh, contre uh, uh, je ne sais pas le, le nom des équipes. Um, C'est une belle équipe, uh, Berta. Big shot from uh, Conte. To bear with me, guys, this uh, got started pretty quick uh, just after the uh, semi. Um, had to have a, a quick water break. Uh, so, just getting set up. Uh, but this is the first end. <clears throat> It'll take me a minute to uh, get back on track with uh, exactly what's going on. Um, and just while I share to uh, other pages. <laughs> Looks a bit short there from uh, Conte with his last ball. Cheers. So, uh, That was Conte's last ball, not the one before. Um, it's taking the point. But that's uh, made, sir. Made the team uh, opportunity to uh, do something. He's going to take on the shot, try and clear that ball out. He's taking on the point. It's good. Takes it. That was just pulled to the side. Um, it's just one point. Hi <laughs> Serge, Tim, thanks for joining. This is the uh, final, the uh, Grand Prix de saint avertin uh, It's been a long day. Uh, it's been going on for uh, just over 12 hours now. Uh, 8.30 start this morning. Uh, it's now uh, just after 9. So, uh, taking the point, that one from uh, Laurent. And uh, the team's going to take on the shot now. Really low shot, uh, but he's hit the carrow. Uh, no loop on uh, or arc on that shot. Just played it really low, uh, driven into the ground almost. But uh, hits, it stays, takes the point. Uh, Conte replies in kind. The hit and the carrow. Cheers, pass. So, a uh, miss there from uh, the team in Dublin. Do you know their names? Do you know their names? I'll find out. Or just, just where they're from. Another miss. Um, hmm? Is it three? It was three points the last end. Uh, looked like one from uh, from here, but uh, Jason just informed me it was three, so it's uh, 3-0. the first end. 
started at 7 0. It started at 7 0. Okay, so um, start this game at 7 0. Um, I think uh, Conte's got a long way to go. Um, this evening, when he finishes here, he's got a uh, big competition in uh, Oloron um, tomorrow. Uh, it's got about a four and a half, five hour drive. That's probably why we're seeing the uh, aggressive play, uh, trying to get this wrapped up quickly. Uh, so it's 10-7 uh, it's to um, the uh, team in dark blue. i uh, find out soon exactly who they are. Um, the blues bounce out. So Lawrence will just uh, coming up short there. Um, got another one to go. That takes a point. With uh, Conte still holding one. Right then, I think that's three. Uh, so, uh, four, Jason thinks four, someone at the side of me thinks three. Four, quatre points, uh, four points for Conte, so uh, 11, 10, uh, 11, 10. So this could be one of the uh, quickest finals uh, we've uh, we've seen. Uh, two ends gone already. It's 11:10. Uh, uh, of course, even starting from zero, you can uh, finish a match in three ends. Uh, it's the uh, the three end funny. So uh, not sure if someone can uh, help Tim out there and uh, type the score. It's 11:10 uh, to uh, Quante. Two misses there. It's going again. Three misses. Snicked it with the first one, but then uh, missed with the other two. Um, it's a shame. I mean, this uh, this other team that's playing against Conte here uh, played really well. I think they uh, funnied the uh, last team in the semi-final. Um, cheers, Daniel. Okay, so uh, got the team names now uh, of the, uh, the other team that's uh, playing against Conte. So, of course, uh, Conte playing with uh, Laurent Magnier and the uh, team they're against that uh, looks about likely to uh, be beaten is uh, Sebastian Boffi, uh, who plays for Epi Tour Nord. Uh, so, that's a uh, club in the north of Tour, um, so probably about a 15 minute drive away from here. And uh, Fauvi Gatien, who plays for uh, Gen, uh, which is uh, in a different department, not quite sure where that is. Um, they've been playing really well. Um, demolished some teams on the way here. And uh, Conte's hit that, it's game over. Um, so, quick game, playing from 7 all. Uh, it's 13 uh, 10, uh, over in three ends. It's a shame, might have gone a different way had they played the uh, the full game, but a uh, little bit of sportsmanship going on there. Um, as I uh, say, Conte's got a long way to go, uh, a four and a half, five hour drive to uh, Oloron, uh, ready to play in a big tournament tomorrow with uh, Sushio, uh, and possibly uh, Damien Hulot as well, there's uh, another Oloron player. Uh, but uh, never mind, uh, it's been a great day, uh, been a great tournament. Uh, some great, uh, some great petonks being played, and uh, hopefully we'll be uh, back here next year. And uh, we hope to see a few more teams from uh, England taking part as well. Uh, thanks to everybody for uh, taking part, joining in, watching, uh, commenting. Um, keep an eye on our feed on uh, This Is Petonk, and uh, keep an eye on ThisIsPetonk.com for our article, which will be coming soon, probably in the next couple of days.
<coughs> and we'll see you all again in a week's time at the British Open. Adios. Thanks a lot. Bonsoir. Et.